Well, guys, you might see that I'm still working to pull up the transport out there. I just like pull it this board here. I didn't disconnect it yet. I see there are quite a few connectors. I pull it out the Dolby board, so it was not complicated. It has just three connectors from each side: white, white, and blue. And from the other side, white, red, and blue. And you can pull these boards out, and it's Dolby boards, and we can work on them separately. Really nice. Uh, so there is a large board with playback and record amplifier. I'm afraid we would need to work on capacitors on replacements because it sounds like a very teeny for me. Uh, here is the main processor board which controls operation. So there is display board. That's a bias generator. Okay, let's see what we can do with this guy. Quite a few work would be, I believe. At least it works, so this gives me a sign of hope that at the end it should work perfectly. Let's see. So next I will be pulling out tape transport and see how, like, separate it and work on it. So I believe here we have a uh, rice head connector and it goes to the heads. Let's see just right here. Come on. Here it's so here is a playback head. It's very tight. Let's go between all those wires. Uh, crazy. Okay, and maybe here we have a record head just right here. Connect it. Done. Let me see this connector. Pull it up and just pull like that and red is the first on this side so when i will assemble back so this like red wire is the first it comes here okay let me disconnect everything like and i will pull out the tape transport and we will work on it thank you see you